in Shining World Compassion Award News from Brisbane, Australia. 11-year-old Ashton Brown is the founder of Homeless Helpers, a charity in Queensland, Australia, helping individuals in less fortunate circumstances. We help people. It just naturally feels good for us. On September 17th, 2018, our association members from Brisbane Centre presented Ashton with the Shining World Compassion Award from Supreme Master Ching Hai. The beautifully written award letter from Master describes the exemplary work by young Ashton. At age nine, you told mum you wanted to help homeless people around the world. That's when you started planning, setting goals, holding fundraisers, creating a legal charity, and the list continues. And now, after achieving many goals at a ripe old age of 11, you've become an inspiration, a beacon of hope and altruism. The homeless know that someone deeply cares for them. Your motto, we can't help everyone, but everyone can help someone, defines the wisdom and love that you are so generously shared. In addition to the award, our beloved Master lovingly contributed 10,000 US dollars to help further Ashton's benevolent work. The young humanitarian also received gifts that included a collection of Master's publications as well as a range of DVDs and CDs. Ashton happily expressed his appreciation. I would like to thank Supreme Master Ching Hai for the generous donation which will help me to help the homeless and to change their lives for the better. Your support will help us reach more people in need every day and we can't thank you enough. Congratulations Ashton Brown and Homeless Helpers. We marvel at your kindness and thank you for providing care and comfort to people in need. May you be blessed in divine grace as you continue your loving efforts. For the full presentation of Ashton's Shining World Compassion Award, please tune in to Enlightening Entertainment at a later date. Supreme Master Ching Hai is deeply grateful to the beloved God for all the financial help, comfort, and support to the afflicted and needy and or any good cause over the years as a humble vessel for hearers, compassion and love toward hearers precious children. UNHCR helps refugees use their skills to rebuild livelihoods. The United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees launched the Made 51 project to facilitate employment for refugees through the sale of their traditional crafts. Collaborating with commercial designers and social enterprises, Made 51 brings refugee-made products such as home furnishings, fine embroidery and jewellery to the international marketplace. In Asia, Made 51 partners with Earth Air, which worked with 100 plus refugee women artisans in Malaysia, bringing their hand embroidered bracelets and necklaces to the market. We laud your caring efforts, UNHCR, Made 51, Earth Air, and all partners. Our gratitude for creating the means for refugees to achieve self sufficiency. May more projects like this one help our sisters and brothers in their time of need create bright tomorrows in heaven's grace. Sweden extracts energy from waste. Sweden currently has 34 waste-burning plants that use rubbish instead of coal or gas to produce electricity, heating and biogas to run their transportation. The plants incinerate the rubbish at 815 degrees Celsius and produce enough heating for 1.25 million apartments and electricity for 680,000 homes. There is also sufficient biogas produced to power 200 buses, taxis and cars. The initiative is helping Sweden to reach its objective of being 100% renewable by 2040. Nice work, Sweden, on your intelligent use of waste to warm your citizens and power their homes. May your sustainable energy goals be quickly achieved. Researchers discover fruit colour matches local animals' vision. A research team led by Dr. Omar Nevo from the University of Ulm in Germany and Dr. Kim Valenta from Duke University in the United States have found that ripe fruits in Uganda and Madagascar generally have colors to match the vision of the local animals. In Uganda, 
where ripe fruits are mostly bright red, the local birds and monkeys who have color vision similar to humans can easily find them. In Madagascar, however, the primary fruit eating animals are lemurs who are nocturnal so do not see bright colors. Researchers found that they can easily spot the shade of green of the ripe fruits that are common in the country. Many thanks Dr. Omer Nevo, Dr. Ken Valenta and team for showing the interesting relationship between flora and fauna in the forest. May your research help to bring further protection to Mother Earth's precious woodlands and her remarkable inhabitants. Persian Gulf states to embrace artificial intelligence for the future. The Persian Gulf states are working towards educating their youth in the leading edge technologies such as artificial intelligence, automation and robotics. With 60% of the population under the age of 25, the region has a high digital literacy and larger than average government spending on education. The Persian Gulf nations also plan to foster a suitable environment to attract talented specialists and engineers to the region to help with the development of these advanced technologies. Fantastic news! Countries of the Persian Gulf on your plans to increase opportunities through technology. May your young people find much success as they venture into the world of high-tech and help to bring wonderful enhancements to our world. United Kingdom City trials bus that improves air quality. Southampton is home to the UK's first air filtering bus known as the Blue Star Bus. The vehicle is fitted with a filtration system on its roof that is designed to trap 99.5% of toxic air particles and expel clean air. Blue Star is operated by UK public transport company Go Ahead, whose chief executive David Brown stated, We want this pilot to show that buses should be looked at as not just the solution to congestion in cities, but also as a solution to the air quality problem, wishing fresh air and easy breathing for Southampton residents and visitors. Also, our appreciation go ahead and other collaborators for this innovative step towards healthier living. Celebrities raise over 1.2 million US dollars for animal rights organization. United States celebrities, including Alicia Silverstone, Kat Von D, and more, gathered together at the Merciful Animals Hidden Heroes Gala in Los Angeles, USA, to honor animal advocates. The gala also raised 1.2 million US dollars for the U.S.-based Mercy for Animals undercover investigations, which have helped to expose the inhumane practices of the meat, dairy, and egg industries. Alicia Silverstone, who received the Hope Award at the event, said, I'm so grateful to the animals for saving my life, for making me a healthier, happier, more connected individual, and I will forever be on their side. Bravo and our forever gratitude, Alicia Silverstone and other celebrities for your generosity, and mercy for animals, for your enduring devotion to our kind-hearted animal friends. May your exemplary efforts continue to expand and help lead the world into an everlasting vegan era. Supreme Master Ching Hai also greatly appreciates their compassionate effort and gratefully presents 20,000 US dollars to Mercy for Animals for their noble work, plus the Shining World Compassion Award, with all love and gratitude. May heaven bless you and all involved with success and a long life of happiness. Supreme Master Ching Hai is deeply grateful to the beloved God for all the financial help, comfort and support to the afflicted and needy and or any good cause over the years as a humble vessel for His compassion and love towards His precious children.